we often jump to conclusions not because we know what's going on but we fall prey to circumstances an incident occurred in miss sara's class when student lost an expensive pen miss sara was a strict disciplinarian and could endure anything but stealing she regarded stealing as a sin and decided to check all of her students bags but sheena a young pale faced girl refused to show her bag the teacher persisted rather forced sheena innocent sheena continued to insist that the bag was empty but the teacher thought she was hiding the pen which was the reason she wasn't showing her bag miss sara tried to snatch the bag and in the scuffle sheena fell down the teacher considered sheena the culprit and was constantly accusing her of theft while tears rolled out of sheena's eyes sheena continued pleading that there was nothing in the bag when hearing the commotion the kind and considerate head teacher miss khan marched in miss sara informed her of sheena's misbehavior and demanded strict action sheena reiterated that she hadn't stolen the pen miss khan softly asked her to come along to her office and not to get scared miss khan emphasized that she believed sheena yet she wanted to know what was inside her bag inside the school bag was a black garbage bag to the mentor's astonishment the bag was filled with food scrap trash scrubbers leftovers Sheena was embarrassed and timidly explained that her family had no money and was on the verge of starvation. Her father passed away and so the savings. The mother was ailing and she had no courage left to bear the pale wilted looks of her younger brother. After lunch time she collected the food wasted and left by her schoolmates See children the plight of Sheena because she and her family have no food while we waste food without giving a second thought Miss Khan took a deep sigh and Miss Sara was looking down she had been wrong too quick to judge dear children now it is high time that we realize the importance of food there are so many people who barely manage a single meal a day and our hungry and unfortunate brothers and sisters are starving we should reduce food waste at home by planning our meals consuming leftovers and keeping a track of perishable items we can also curb food wastage by planning our shopping and ordering smaller portions in a restaurant yes dear children minimizing food wastage is something 
that all of us individually should work towards and in the process help those who are not as fortunate as we are. For every grain wasted, we are answerable to God.